Welcome brothers and sisters. Welcome to the next video of Triple Grace. My name is Michael. I'm the founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Path Movement Foundation. And the topic of this video is prophetic voices. They are all chiming in in unity. What am I talking about? If you go now to so many prophetic pages that do a culmination of prophetic voices that come forth on YouTube, Facebook and all other social media, you will see one thing, that they are all fine-tuned now into unity. They are talking about the same events happening now, all of them. Some years back you had prophetic messages all over the place, everything completely different from one another. But now we are at a time when God is moving mightily through the prophetic voices with one message, that the end times are here, that the kingdom has come and that we are standing just minutes before sudden destruction. All the voices are declaring that war is coming. All the voices are declaring that through peace and safety sudden destruction is coming for us. And all the voices are declaring that the Lord is raising up a remnant army right now to stand against that evil flood. They are all chiming into in unity. They are all saying the same words. They are all saying the same message that is coming from the kingdom of heaven. The time is now. I've never seen that in all my long years of experience. I've never seen that the voices are so close together. Almost some uh, as if they are using the same message, the same letter that was sent from heaven. Some are the same wordings even that are coming forth. At the same day, God is moving mightily, brothers and sisters, and you must open your eyes. You must stand ready now. You must put on your full armor. The time is here. Great things will happen. A great shaking is coming. This mega event is at our door. The Lord will send out his angels and they will shake this world and all the nations. You are called. Watch that video for today about Jeremiah 1. You are called into your destiny now. Your calling is there. You were called even before you were placed in the womb of your mother. You were consecrated for such a time as this. Your calling is here to stand for the kingdom. So you need to separate yourself. Do not think about the world. There will be other times when you can think about the world. Now it's the time to think about the kingdom and the kingdom alone. Now it's the time that you must stand with the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Now it's the time that you have to be ready. Now it's the time that you have to be on your knees to say, Lord, transform me. Take me forward now. Allow me to enter my destiny. Allow me to be your true ambassador on earth and send me wherever you want to send me and put the words your words in my mouth so that I speak them correctly, that I only bring forth the truth that you want to bring to your people, to the lost souls, to the prodigal sons and daughters, to the lost sheep, to the harvest that has to be brought in. Now it's the time. Pray to the Father that you, he will allow you to walk as a true son and daughter in the image of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. The heavens will open. The shadow of glory will cover you. You will receive kingdom powers and you will enter your destiny and purpose now. This is a time. 2021 January, the festival, the new year of trees. Jeremiah 1 will start right now. It is starting in front of your eyes. There is an army in the north that will come against Israel and another army from the north that will come against the United States. The words are there. Go to prophetic sites like 444 Prophecy News. You will see all the words are in synchronity. They are all aligning to one another. And all are telling you one thing. The kingdom has come. End times are here. Judgments will fall. War is coming. Sudden destruction will, will be seen in the holy nation. 
people will go into captivity, Antichrist will rise, all in the same, same messages. The prophetic voices are brought together to wake you up, because God will not move before he is not telling all what he is planning to do through his prophets. This is a time when you need to learn, study the prophetic words, see what is coming, put them together, make yourself a list, see that what I am telling you is the truth. When they say peace and safety, sudden destruction will come. We are at that time frame of your calling now, the new year of trees. Four months before the harvest will take place, four months before Pentecost. This is the time. And you are standing with the kingdom. You have made yourself ready. And I'm so grateful that you all have joined and that you will be part of Triple Grace and you are standing in the remnant army of kings and priests because God can count on you. He has prepared you well. You have your destiny and you will fulfill it now. Praise the Lord for all the powerful warriors that he is bringing forth right now. Praise the Lord for everything what he is doing now on earth. Kingdom, The kingdom of God will advance. The worldly kingdoms will go down. Nations will fall. But the kingdom of God will advance. And with the advancement of the kingdom of God, sin will be pushed out of the world. Evil will be destroyed. We are in the sealed tribulation, brothers and sisters. God is with us. If we stand always with the kingdom of God, let us remove all of our worldly thinking. Let us remove everything that brings us onto a wrong path, the path to Satan. Let us remove everything and let us stand with the kingdom of God and say, Father, guide me. Show me the path. Let me know where I have to go and I will go with a glad heart because you are sending me and I know that you will never leave nor forsake me and that you will provide everything for you. I am your willing vessel. Send me out now. My calling is here. Jeremiah 1 is here. Sudden destruction will follow. We will start the Lord has said that many times we will start now before sudden destruction will come to this earth. So it's our time now. This is a time now when we will rise up. The army is now ready to stand and to charge the, the enemy on the battle lines, to take the battle to the gates. God is pouring out his kingdom powers to his chosen vessels. Brothers and sisters, be blessed in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen and Amen. Maranatha.